Good morning, and I just wanted to let you guys know that today is the day of the Great Thrift Off Challenge, and it's going to be between several of us female resellers. Um, it's on the Junking Data Girls channel, and I believe it's at 5, well, my time is 5, 6 p.m. Eastern. Um, I'm going to have a lot of goodies. We each got a little area of, um, like home goods and accessories and clothes and ephemera and all that good stuff so i wanted to show you guys a little preview of what i'm gonna have tonight i just woke up i'm sorry so i will grab those things okay so my items today for hard goods slash home goods it are um this red fairy lamp it's the circular one um it's very very pretty it is a flashed fairy lamp, so it's not solid red glass, but I do think it'll be a great flip. Um, I picked up this very pretty old compact. It's got like an art deco look on the front. And it's like swirly on the back, but you can tell it's super old. There's the mirror. There's where your powder puff goes. And there's where your powder goes. And it still smells of powder, so I'm going to have to clean it up a little before the sale. I think I already have someone interested in that, so that's cool. Um, I picked up this little Namco Wear piggy bank, and I thought he was awesome. He does need a stopper, so maybe I can go by Lowe's today and see if I can find one. Um, and that'll just have to come out of my cost, I guess, but a really good deal on him. I have a brand new St. John's Bay purse that has a tag for 50 bucks inside and little inserts. I have the Rosetti purse that is new with tags, has a $40 tag on it. So for, you know, our online resellers, it'll be a good flip. A festival bag, which is very sparkly and pretty and crossbody. Um, uh, that's like my stylist festival looking stuff, so come on. Yeah. Hopefully somebody will be interested in that. For my um clothing part, I have this beautiful incline I'm sorry, not incline, loft um jumpsuit. And it's a size extra extra small. And it's polka dots. And I just think it is like the prettiest thing ever. And it's got little short legs because it is for a petite person. I have this beautiful mustard um, button down dress with embroidery. It is missing one button towards the bottom. It's a long dress. So. There's a missing button that'll need to be replaced, but I think it's just beautiful. And then I have another clothing item, and it's just a Wrangler Pearl Snap, and it seems very, very big, but it's like 24-32, and I don't know what size that is. I've tried researching it. Um, for my ephemera, I have this 1967 edition of the life magazine it's got the peanuts on it just because i thought they'd be different from the like major collector something i learned from the antique room ad was that um sorry my dog's my dad's dog's opening the door and <laughs> snorting like a pig bill what are you doing and um it's got really cool ads it's fun to look through um, one thing I learned from him was, like, don't pick up, like, the JFK assassination and Princess Diana and all that because so many people have it. So I got one that I didn't think, like, everybody would save. But, um, my next one is How to Draw Fashion. It's from the year 1950. The cover has come detached from the inside. 
and that happened in my possession so of course Hulk smash and destroy everything but it shows you how to draw well it's to draw fashion but look it teaches you all the faces lips and eyes and noses and stuff which that is like my um, kryptonite when it comes to art these legs Skip the page. This is there's the different positions, legs, um, has some real older women posing, and some of the photos. It's just really, you know, there's like a simple body sketch. <laughs> needs help coming up the ramp so Rudo he'll be barking for a second this is the 18 best love loved bird printing by Audubon and if you're a reseller you know just scoop these up and sell them off individually we've got the field sparrow we've got the ruby throated hummingbirds these are in really great condition <clears throat> Summer Tanager? Janager? I don't know. The Wild Turkey. The Goldfinch, which that's the bird that pops in on my video sometimes. The Belted Kingfisher. The Bobolink. The American. Red Star. I love the bees. Okay. Purple Finch. Blue Jay. Warlers and Bluebirds. Ooh, Great Blue Heron. That's a real pretty one. Morning Love. I'm coming, Bruno. Man, let me see how many that is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm counting thirteen. Fourteen, fifteen. And then they have these sheets, so it's actually sixteen prints. The envelope said there would be 20, but I got this out of the blue market. Um, Bruno, this is a drawing from JJ Arbon and Steve Beard. Grebel, G R E B E L. I think they're super cute. These three have holes in them, like they were from the calendar. Yeah, they are. In the 1967 calendar that we have writing on the back. This is the Shore Life, which I think looks like miniature owls. They are super cute. And this is the Wild Turkey. And oh my god, look at the babies on the bottom. So all of that's going to be one, one lot for my ephemera. And just to make it more awesome, because you know I like the strange stuff, it says Somebody in closet on the envelope. And I don't know. I just think that's a cool, really cool ephemera item, a media item. Um, so that's it for what I'm gonna offer tonight on my part of the so there's gonna be a, quite a bit of us, so hopefully we can knock it out quick we're gonna try to move fast um so I hope like people who support me and other communities or my communities will come and show their love for me and even if you don't buy anything you know just come share your support and it'll be really super fun and I'll link everything down below and thank you guys for watching please like comment subscribe and let me know what you think will be the best item of mine for the Thrift Off 2020 competition. Thanks, guys. Bye.